First, put www.sunny-portal.de in your internet browser. You will find the PV System Setup Assistant in the bottom right of the home page. I will now use this to register the PV system in the Sunny Portal. You will see general information about the PV System Setup Assistant. I click Next to start the registration. The first step is to register, which you can do as either a new or an existing user account. In this case, I'll use an existing account and enter my data, then click Next. In the second step, please enter the name of the PV system and the PV system password. You should have already entered the name of the PV system and the same password you used when the inverter was commissioned. In the next step, the inverter's specific PIC and registration ID are asked for. You can find these on the type label or in your documents. Simply enter the numbers and click Next. After Sunny Portal identifies the system, the inverter is displayed here. So I click Next. Continue entering the PV system data. This example deals with a 4.0 kilowatt peak system with an annual yield of approximately 1,000 kilowatt hours. Next, the location is asked for. This PV system is located on King Street in Sydney, Australia. I activate an automatic update of the devices in the PV system by checking the corresponding box. In addition, I make the PV system available to sunny places. This is the free community portal for end customers. To do so, I enter the PV system operator's email address. The PV system operator will then receive an invitation to sunny places and can log in to the end customer portal. In sunny places, the end customer sees their PV system's performance and can communicate with other PV system operators. At the bottom of the input screen, I check the box to activate SMA Smart Connected. This will set the inverter up to be automatically checked by SMA. If a fault occurs, both the PV system operator and the installer in charge are informed. If the inverter is faulty, a replacement device is automatically sent free of charge. Click Service Description to receive a summary of everything that SMA Smart Connected includes. This provides detailed information about the services offered to customers and SMA's obligations. When you activate SMA Smart Connected by checking the box, a new input screen opens. Here you are asked to enter the operator's and installer's data as well as the delivery address for a replacement device. You do not necessarily have to enter a value-added tax ID. If you don't have one on hand, uncheck the box. It is essential to enter the data on this page correctly so that the PV system operator can also use SMA Smart Connected. Then click Next. You will receive a summary in the last registration step. You can recheck the entries you have made and then complete the registration. Configuration of the PV system can take a moment. You can see here that registration was successful. Now I click To the PV system to go directly to my sample system. Here you have an overview of the system. If you want to activate SMA Smart Connected later or change the necessary data, e.g. the delivery access for a replacement device, you can do so on the left in the menu bar under Configuration. Then click Device Overview. Your inverter appears in the list. Then click Properties. Here you can see the inverter details and below are the details about the SMA Smart Connected service package. To change your data, just click Edit at the bottom of the page. If you want to activate SMA Smart Connected later, you can do that here. Activate SMA Smart Connected, enter all necessary data, and save. You can log off from the sunny portal up here in the top right corner. And this concludes registration in the sunny portal with activation of SMA Smart Connected.